Hi. Hi. How are you? How are you, young lady? Hi. Come here. Come here. I have candy. I have a lot of candy. You love candy, huh? You love candy. Wow. I have many candy. Do you take? Come. One candy. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm really sorry. Don't do that again. No, no, not that. Not that. Whoa! 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 Hey, cut it out. Hey, hey, not the drill again, man. No, no! Ha, 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 ha. 
Now, I'm not convinced that these assholes are doing all this stuff for lost. I mean, they almost all have ready access to the slickest looking hookers around. I'm convinced that these guys are devout Satanists, and this is like, to them, their version of a, an Easter Sunday service. And they, you know, here we're, we're proving to our Lord and Master that we're serious and committed, and that, uh, you know, we know that He hates Yahweh and. Oh, we, we want to show that we're on his side. You know, he has given us, he's shown us that there are no limits. He's shown us that, you know, we can screw anything we want. He has, he has shown us that we can kill anybody we want, that there are no limits, that we're a piece of God, and he's freed us from all these lies. And, you know, we want to reign in hell with him. He's promised us that we'll reign in his kingdom when we die. And so we want to, we want to go there. We want our children to go there. And this is a nice, devout service that we're having. I'm convinced that they're there, all this stuff. A nice, devout service to Satan. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm convinced. It's, it can't be the lost. Give mm -hmm. me a break. Mm -hmm. You know. So, that's, uh, you know, so we got to understand that that's why Jesus wanted us to be so committed. He wanted us all in because the other side sure is, I'll tell you what. You know, and... Uh, they want, they want lies, theft, murder, and destruction, including their own destruction, including their posterity's destruction. Buddy, that is all in. And, uh, you know, that's why we got to really fight our own selfishness. We are not to ignore our needs. We're supposed to put our needs last. You know, I mean, we count too, but we're supposed to put our needs last. And that's the complete opposite of, of them, you know, and, and, uh, uh, so I, I think what we're dealing with here is real devout Satanists, and their, that's their evangelism campaign. Yeah, so, uh, Jonathan, in this uh, this uh, sh brief video, are you uh, advocating uh, vigilantism, or are you advocating uh, things No, like I didn't make the video to advocate uh, vigilantism. Just like we said about abortion, okay. um, it's, 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 it's easy to justify morally, but I'm not advocating it, and I'm no. not setting anyone up to do it, and I'm not... Uh, encouraging anyone to do it. I want people to organize, just like with abortion, and really, I think it's the same fight. It's the, it's it's the destruction same, but... of innocence. Okay? Yeah, that's right. Yeah, that's right. And the, and the uh, sexual penetration of children or the penetration with a scalpel or a, or, a, or other surgical mm -hmm. instrument is... Mm -hmm. is um, worship. It's, yeah, it's a worship of Satan who hates people made in the image of God and hates oh, yeah. uh, infants because, because God, the second Adam, Jesus Christ, came the womb of a woman in the form of an infant okay uh -huh. that's why he hates the seed of the woman yeah. that's why he hates the child in the womb so yeah. no i'm not advocating it i'm not telling anyone to do it I'm i'll tell you what speaking for myself i think if you don't if these ideas don't occur to you i think there's something wrong with something's you something's wrong with you yeah, yeah. Like, uh, if you yeah. don't think about it something's no, wrong yeah, with you. Yeah. these children deserve to be defended from pedophilia i'm not telling you not to do it that's right and the we're not. Children, we're not telling you to do the it. The children yet. in the womb deserve to be defended from yeah. uh, abortion. And the these... whole movement's been f effeminized yeah. and feminized, yeah. and both of them are wrong. Effeminacy yeah. is something men do. It's very wicked. Yeah. Okay. Very wicked. I saw a preacher recently that said, if you, you know, if you're a Christian man who who's gotten in touch with uh, your feminine side, send that demon back to hell. Yeah, that's right. Red that's Johnson. right. That's right. That ain't right. That's right. That ain't right. Okay. Uh, God created you to be a man, then the best man you can, and use the gifts that he gave you. Defend innocent children. They said Lion of Judah is a description. That's that's a pretty high testosterone that's right. model. That's right. Okay. And this thing of uh, pacifism is incompatible. What? Pacifism, let me say it again. Pacifism is incompatible with Christianity. We are not Mohammedans, okay? Mm -hmm. We do not uh, uh, evangelize at the point of the a gun or the sword. But God has called us, the Holy God, Jesus Christ himself, has called us to defend innocent children. He said it would be better uh, if a man, when a man offended one of these little ones that believe in him, it would be better that a millstone were tied around his neck and he were thrown into the deepest sea. Then what? Implied is, then what Jesus 
will do to him. Mm -hmm. Okay, mm -hmm. we're supposed to defend them. And if there's any question about that, look in the Gospel of Luke. The Lord Jesus Christ commanded his disciples to take swords, not to stop him from being crucified. He told them already. Yeah. That's what they had to do. So Peter was wrong to cut off the, the, the servant of the high priest, his ear. But why did Jesus tell him to take the swords to defend the innocent? Thank you very much, Arthur.